Good morning. Welcome back to Kentucky Fried Fishing. We've made the drive up to Carabell with my aunt and uncle. We are taking the Lures 290 out to do some bottom fishing around 30-35 uh, miles offshore. Michelle knows we're going, but Michelle's not up yet, so our cold entry today is waking her up for the fishing trip. Let's go. Shelly, good morning. Hey, remember you said you wanted a boat ride? Boat ride, come on. It's 4 30 in the morning. It's time to go for the boat ride. Boat ride, come on. Come on. You said you wanted to go ride in the boat ride. Come on, wakey wakey. Some bottom dropping. We got Michelle up there. We got Ernest and Roger. They're debating the limits of fish being in. So we'll continue on. Keep having her fun. We're hugging the channel. Through the magic of YouTube, we'll be back in uh, about three hours of travel and 30 seconds for you. As we're cruising out, we do want to take a chance to show everybody the new Kentucky Fried Fishing shirts that we will sell just to help pay for all the fun. Michelle, give us a spin.
Yeah. First fish. You have first fish. Yeah. First fish. When the rod goes down. Yes, you get first fish. So you gotta. You just crank. We'll walk you through it. Okay. back to the monologue everybody uh, so far we've spent about three hours trolling with no luck so, now we're gonna try some bottom dropping and some jigging got some good current today I do want to give a big shout out you will see a lot of gale force rods um, I fished with them on the Yankee cap great people um, really knowledgeable anglers but they have produced this gale force rod line that I absolutely just some of the best rods I've ever used uh, a yeah. little expensive, but you're going to see when we're jigging just how well made the slow force rod is for jigging. Uh, I got hit by yeah. a submarine, and it bent it all the way down and snapped braid, and that rod never failed. Thought it was going to, almost cut the line, but the 50-pound braid failed before the rod did so I'm not sponsored by them I don't get anything for free from them but if you get a chance check out the Gale Force rods because they are phenomenal rods here I'll show you just tell them your radio check is okay. Here, what you did, you pick it up, you push the button. Radio check, radio check, one six, one six, radio check. Your radio's working on one six, you shouldn't be doing it on one six. Thank you, Cap. Yeah, see? One six is the Coast Guard channel. And that is emergencies only. That's why we get to be jerks to him. Two. Oh, it's flounder in. Yeah. Well, we got a flounder. Can't use flounder for bait, can we? Unless you cut them up and go to pieces. Yeah. I think that's correct. I mean, they, they gotta be 12 or 14. 12 or 14, gotcha. Yeah, you do what you want to do on it. I don't. I ain't picky. I was just gonna throw this on it. Here. Let me see above the way home. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Yeah, that anchor down will help us out too.
I tossed that flounder back. I didn't think we could use that. We're good. He got it to work. I think he was putting the wrong end down. And that's what it was. He was just putting the wrong end of the bait down. Oh, I don't know. In my boat, it oh, you can use either one of those two poles over there. You just got to tie proper stuff on. Yep. Downstairs yep. Or you can throw the. I think the uh, sabiki is going to be too small. So we are now about four hours into the fishing day. We've stopped and got nine to eleven uh, bait fish. Uh, Ernest and Roger were calling them squirrel fish. I had a couple mechanical issues this and that uh, so we are now finally bottom fishing and we couldn't ask for better conditions it's you know as the song goes the weather was here wish the fish were biting for a minute. Yeah. Why just he got off the hook? I don't know how he got off the hook. I don't either. He did, didn't he? Yep. They call fishing, not catching. Oh, yeah. Yep. Uh, I think he's fighting you. No, no, no. This is fighting. No, I don't. Oh. Uh, of course I am. Okay. See color. Oh hell look at it. Look at that group for your face. Yeah, that's a hell of a group. Get that door open. Yep. Ha <laughs> ha! Dinner is served. I don't know if that was legal or not. 
or not. That's a lesser. There's an amberjack and a lesser. A pair of pliers right here somewhere. Right over there. Here's your pliers. You'll have to check and see if you here you go. Here's your pair of pliers. Oh, I've got me a pair of pliers. Don't forget that one. That one's that red grouper one yeah. Where's the other one at? But still, uh, less amberjack. I didn't think amberjack was over there. Uh, greater. Uh, what's the, where are you find lesser at? Keep moving around the thing there. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know what they are, where they're at. Did you see that big ass grouper that was following that one up? Yes, I did. Lesser amberjack. Minimum size. Four, look, cannot be less than 14 or greater than 22 fork length. That is. Right there. That is a lesser. Between 14 and 22. It's got to be at least 14. 14 to 22, that's the problem. Uh, nope. Oh, what? 26. There's one jig, one jig gone. Whatever that was, was uh, big. Yeah, I've never seen it. Well, it, the rod did not break. Well, you, you didn't get him in either. No, I didn't. <laughs> no, I didn't. Whoo! Wow. That's a submarine. Yeah, that submarine, is. yeah. Something hit it on the way down, I guess, grouper. Big, probably a big grouper. Big grouper, yeah. Or one of the big amber jacks. Yeah. Cleaned it right off. Snapped. Oh. Or a big cabara. Oh, hell. Oh, tell me. You got off. No. We'll better get the radio open the gate for him. He's going to need to move. It's a lesser amberjack. Is it amberjack? Is it lesser than 22? I don't know. We're moving our stuff to you. Oh, he ain't done yet. Yeah. No. I was only about. Oh, 20 foot deep. Come on. Oh. You get off? Yep. No? Nah. Man, that, when he runs toward you, oh, here comes the shark or something after. Right. Oh, fuck that up. You get a shark after him? Here, I just the door. We'll throw him in here and see what we got. Sure, it looks like it to me. Yeah. It what looks about you guys? Yep. I don't know what they look like. Lesser amberjack on the board. Finally. 
between 14 and 22 and inches. And that's all we got for this one. Slow day, realistic fishing is always promised. Sometimes we don't catch it, sometimes we do. Roger over there has got one lesser amberjack between 14 and 22. My amberjack, lesser amberjack, was 26 inches, so it got to go back and get killed by a shark. Michelle's worn out, so we're going to go get cleaned up and start planning the next one.